There is no doubt that wealth is a blessing from Allah Azza wa Jal. It is a ni'mah from the ni'am of Allah Azza wa Jal. If it were not for, uh, for Allah Azza wa Jal, we would not have been able to live, nor would we have been able to earn even a single dirham for ourselves. Allah Azza wa Jal gave this to us. And that means, like every single ni'mah, two things we must be aware of. The first, that we will be asked about this ni'mah on the Day of Judgment. ثُمَّ لَتُسْأَلُنَّ يَوْمَئِذٍ عَنِ النَّعِيمِ Then, on that day, you will be asked about the ni'am, the blessings that Allah Azza wa Jal gave to you. He's going to ask the fact that you will not move on the Day of Judgment until you are asked about your wealth. And this wealth that you are asked about, you will be asked about two things. Where did you earn it from? And what did you spend it on? You will not move and I will not move on the day of judgment until Allah Azza wa Jal asks you, where did you get it from? And where did you spend it in? Or what did you spend it on? And if this is from the blessings of Allah, the great blessings of Allah Azza wa Jal that He gave to us, then we need to be aware of a principle. And that is the principle of shukrun ni'mah, of being grateful for the blessings that Allah Azza wa Jal has given us. And this is perhaps best said in the ayah in which Allah Azza wa Jal said, وَإِذْ تَأَذَّنَ رَبُّكُمْ لَإِنْ شَكَرْتُمْ لَأَزِيدَنَّكُمْ وَلَإِنْ كَفَرْتُمْ إِنَّ عَذَابِي لَشَدِيدٌ Allah Azza wa Jal said, If you give thanks, if you are grateful for what I have given you, I'll give you more. And if you are ungrateful, كَفَرْتُمْ here either means to be ungrateful or to disbelieve. And the word is the same because disbelief is the ultimate example of being ungrateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Then my punishment is severe. So Allah Azza wa Jal has told us that every single blessing He has given us, we have to give thanks for. And if we are ungrateful, then the danger is that this blessing will become an adab, a punishment, that Allah Azza wa Jal will punish us.